Hey guys, thought you might be interested in a day out at a Japanese zoo. No expert on animals though, so you'll have to identify these animals for yourself. It's either a turtle or a tortoise, isn't it? Tortoise is the land animal, maybe? Maybe. So of course the animals in the zoo are from all over the world, they're not just Japanese animals of course. For example, the anteater. Those people who watch our other channel have already seen a minute with this anteater. So if you haven't seen that and you're interested in anteaters, go to the other channel you'll be able to see a minute with this character. Isn't he cool? Huge too. It's a giant anteater it's called and it really was it really was quite giant. Hello! Can't remember what that was. Is it a marmot? I don't know. It's one of those things. It's a cute thing, isn't it? Hello! The bird there. See his little friend on the ground? That's pretty cute. A little bird sitting there beside him. Um, this animal is actually made of spare parts that were left over from other animals. <laughs> I don't know, I can't remember what this is called either. I think this is the African part of the, or the South American part of the zoo, I can't remember. But he does look like he's made of spare parts, doesn't he? <laughs> oh dear. Uh, porcupines? Very cute. In a spiky sort of way. Maybe this is a bison. Maybe. Our American friends might be able to tell us if that's a bison. And if this is a buffalo. Or is it the other way around? Or are they something totally different? See that one standing there in his water? And these cute things. So guys, uh, we've mentioned this on previous videos. Uh, we make videos about what exists in Japan without trying not to be too judgmental about it as much as possible. Um, just because we make videos about zoos and aquariums and things doesn't necessarily mean we support them. So a lot of people feel uncomfortable seeing animals caged in zoos and things. Other people think that having animals in cages in zoos encourages people to like animals and supports them and encourages breeding of them and stops things going uh, obsolete or no, what do you call it, going uh, disappearing, keeps animal different breeds alive, different animals alive instead of having them becoming endangered and so on. So there's different thinking about zoos, whether they're a good thing or a bad thing. This video isn't really about that, this is just showing you what is. The zoo exists, this zoo does exist in Japan, so we're showing you. Same as all the other videos that we make. It doesn't necessarily mean we, we think it's a good thing or a bad thing, or we support it or we don't support it, it's just here it is. Uh, likewise, our videos aren't about what isn't in another country. Often people say, there's nothing special about that, we've got that in our country. Yes, congratulations. That's fabulous. But again, this isn't about what isn't in Argentina or what isn't in America or what isn't in France. This channel is about what is in Japan. So if it happens to be in other countries as well, that's fine. Uh, but we're really not about deciding what's in other countries and what's not. We're just about showing what's in Japan. Look, in Japan there's this zoo and these chimpanzees with a baby chimpanzee. Isn't it cute? There we go. That's an example what is in Japan. This zoo is in Japan with these animals. Dudes hanging out over there. And an elephant. And if you're into elephants, that's uh, we've got an, a minute with this elephant on the other channel as well. We've got a series, those people who don't know about our other channel 
we've got another series, uh, another channel called the Silly Old Dude Channel, and on there there's a series called A Minute with a Critter, and we have a minute with different critters for people just to have a mellow 60 seconds in their day just watching an animal, and that elephant gave us a pretty mellow 60 seconds if you want to want to have a look at that. Not all the animals would have been interesting for a minute. This hippo would not be interesting to watch for a minute. Look, that was it. <laughs> the next minute would be just watching that. Rhino was the same. He just stood there. So we didn't do a minute with the hippo. We didn't do a minute with the rhino because it would be a bit boring. Well, I'm just standing there. There he is. That was it. That was the whole thing. Nevertheless, interesting animal. So yeah, zoo had a monorail running around. Polar bear. Looking pretty mellow there, isn't he? What is that? That's a seal, isn't it? A couple of seals down there. They all seem pretty happy. <laughs> Dude over there, underneath where the water was coming in, he seemed pretty cool. Camel. A minute with a camel would be pretty slow, wouldn't it? Look at that. Hello. This must have been the tall, tall critters enclosure. It had the ostriches and the giraffes. Hello. Very pretty. Very pretty animal, the giraffe, isn't it? Uh, Japanese bear. A couple of different types of bear in Japan, apparently. Tiger from somewhere totally different again. Looking like he's pretty keen to eat somebody. Lions, there's a couple of lions there. Zebras. This is a bit nostalgic for some of us. Some kangaroos. Very cool. And one of the coolest animals in the world, most underrated, one of the most an underrated animals in the world is the emu, Australian emu. You get them like up to two two meters tall, and very very cool bird, very very cool bird. So anyway, there was a zoo in Japan. I hope you found that a little bit interesting. More videos coming soon.